Why, is there a problem? Uh, someone called, was concerned that you were taking pictures of the registrations and uh, well, Like stuff. I said, anything I can see for public. Okay, fair enough. Want to give me your name? Abraham Lincoln. Nice. Welcome to Audit the Law. Today's video comes to you from a new channel that goes by the name of State and Y Audits. In this video, he is conducting a First Amendment audit at the Clayton Municipal Building in Clayton, New York. The building is empty for the most part, but he does run into two different employees, both of which don't tell him much. Let's watch. Maybe we can make a little video of a, uh, just a little video for myself. Just a news story about the uh, Clayton. Okay, for yourself. Correct. Just a little walk around the buildings, our public buildings. And here we go. Okay, guess is down. Hello. What are you doing? Videoing. What are you videoing? Everything. Everything I can see. Oh, everything you can see? Correct. Just for myself, we're good to go. All right. All right. You're not bothering me, and you're not bothering them, you're not harming anyone. Do you mind if I get your name? My name's Terry Joe. Terry Joe, and uh, your position? I'm the DPW superintendent. The DPW superintendent. Okay. Upstate New York audits, leaves the building, and then proceeds to film again when he notices Terry Jones following him down the street. Oddly enough, that's when he was contacted by New York State Trooper Houck. I just changed the plans. Yes, I'm not going to the car. I'm going over here. I turn around, and this guy's following me. Very good. What's going on today? She's out taking some pictures and videos. Taking some pictures and vehicles? Uh, I said pic pictures and videos. Okay, of what? Of whatever I can see. Okay. Uh, would you mind getting on this side so I'm not getting the kids in the background though? Yeah. We just switch sides? Okay. All right, good. Can I get your name, badge number? Trooper Hout. House. Hout. H-A-U-K. Okay. Where, badge where number? are you staying? Badge number? 834. 834, thank you. Where are you staying at? I don't answer questions. Okay. Were you taking pictures of people's registration? Whatever I can see in public. Okay. Why? Because I can. Okay. You staying at... I don't know where that is. Okay. Alright. That's not local. Yeah, it is. Not where I'm staying. Oh, it's not where you're staying? <laughs> yeah. Okay. Are you sure? Positive. Oh, okay. Alright. Why, is there a problem? Uh, someone called was concerned that you were taking pictures of the registrations and huh? well, like stuff. I said anything I can see for public okay fair enough want to give me your name Abraham Lincoln nice what president was he yeah, I don't know you don't know Couldn't tell you. 16th I believe oh uh, maybe yeah. I don't know that much okay sign for it so we good to go I don't know are we good to go you, you you contacted me. I didn't have a problem. I was wondering what you were doing. And I told you what I was doing. Okay. So we're good to go then? Okay. Sounds good. Alright. If I'm free to go, I'm free to stay. So am I. And you're going to stay in here and watch me? Yeah. Stay here? Okay. Pretty much. That's what you get paid for? I guess so. Guess I'm getting paid here. Sounds good. For right now. This is where you guys' tax dollars are going. I'm sorry? This is why I'm doing these videos. Oh. Uh, okay. It's just educational, show people, you know, how their government employees act in public and how they treat the public, you know, okay. what they do with the money that we pay you guys for your, your salaries and stuff, you know. Right. And it's not just to stand here and watch me. Right. With, you know, especially when I'm engaged in protected activity, legal protected activity. You are? So. Did, did I say you were? No, but you're standing here with me right now for no reason. Someone whatsoever. called Yes. Someone called in suspicious activity. It's suspicious act. Is is that a misdemeanor or a felony? Do you see look here? I wasn't recording the play. I wasn't recording the play though. I wasn't recording. I wasn't. I'm sorry. He he doesn't belong here. I don't know him, and he really should go. Oh, I'll stand here all day, ma'am. Sorry. Okay. I wasn't on the playground at all. I had my camera was not recording the playground at all. 
Are we good to go? Are you gonna just stand here with me all day? Cause I'm just gonna stand here until you leave. I'm just gonna stand here. Okay, well I guess I, like. I guess we're on the standoff. I mean, ultimately he's on sidewalk, public property. Yo, I'm on public property. Were you the one who called now? No, oh, okay. no. Actually, I just happened to the city and not I heard the talking. I guess right. I, I'm working. Yeah, someone called. So I'm not hurting nobody. I'm minding my own business. I'm not talking to nobody. So I just didn't think that at least I was taking him cooperative. He's taking pictures of stuff in plain view. And Well, if we get technical, I could go over there and video if I want to. But like I said, I completely avoided the playground. My camera wasn't even rolling when I walked past it. My own kids are over there playing. I'm not going over there. Okay. It's not about that. Are your kids being supervised? Absolutely now? are. By who? By their mother. Okay. Where's mom now? Over there with them. Okay. I don't believe that's any of your business. Is what it is, so. We don't want to take this to a different direction. You're doing good? It's just some public well, photography. Like yeah, I ain't bothering nobody like that, so. There's no need to scare the public. I believe you're scaring the public. With a camera? Yeah. People are scared of a camera. There's cameras everywhere. All right, just don't anything. Don't do anything you're not supposed to. I know I what I'm doing. Grandma wouldn't, wouldn't be proud of. Don't don't give me directives. I don't need directives. Okay. I'm parting advice. That's a directive. How's that? I know what I'm doing. Like yeah. I said. Have a good one. Sir. You too. Do you know? Uh, hey, do you mind if I ask where your uh, police station is located? I'll be over there next. Okay. And that's going to do it for today's video. Do me a favor and go subscribe to Upstate NY Audits and let them know I sent you over. Remember, refusing to show ID to an officer if you have not committed a crime is perfectly legal. It's protected under the Fourth Amendment. An officer needs probable cause of a crime to search or seize your documents. As always, if you enjoyed today's video, be sure to leave a thumbs up and subscribe if you're not already.